Um, Melinda, where are we now? Huh? We're at St. Andrews and we're at Noxaton Pond. We're and Tom's regatta. And what are you rowing? I mean, what are you? <laughs> what are you stirring? Taco salad. It's the famous taco salad. Oh, it's fabulous. And Peggy, how is it's the salad? Awesome. It's just awesome. Just as you remembered just it. Perfect. Just as I remember it. I've never had it before. Uh oh. This is not your sister's taco salad. This is Melinda Lynam's world famous taco salad. And my husband didn't even want to share it with me. So selfish. I know, and he's a I know. Now this is the what's called the second eight. It's another, it's a boys boat group rowing. And the TC Williams crew is who we're cheering for. Let's pretend it's one of these first two boats. Oh, the one on the far side looks like they're doing very well. They might even be ahead right now. And I, oh, it's so close. So close. Wow. Or maybe that's us over here. We don't know. Actually, we don't know for sure. Actually, it's this one here with the guys in red with the blue and white oars. Yeah, that's them. And there's another race on. I think it's that white boat right there. Oh no, actually it's, it's this one right here. I think. I have no idea which one it is. Oh, it's the white one. White one right there. What's your prediction for the race? Uh, they'll do great! They'll do great! Go TC! Go TC! And second, I see right now. Screw it. It's not TC. They're down there. They're down in the river somewhere. There's going to be a lot of water splashing. That's your prediction? A lot of splashed water? A lot of carbon fiber moving through water. TC Williams is back here, and they're going to do well. T.C. Williams crew finished, and next week it's the Aquaquan. See you there. Thanks for watching. Well, they're making him row. <laughs> they're rowing back to the start, and there's Tom in the seventh seat. He's got a uh, left hand door. Starboard door. This is the TC crew de-rigging their boat. This is Tom Lina. They have to take all these brackets off, then put the boats here on the trailer. And after that's done, then they get to be warm, and then they get to eat. It's very complicated, this de-rigging process that people go through, and someday someone's going to invent a fast de-rigging boat. Or something. So they're loading a boat which has been de-rigged onto a trailer. The other middle. The other middle. They're going to tow it on the boat, on the trailer. So this end is going to walk forward and get it in the slot. And so that's, you can see they're loading this boat in and carefully, very carefully, 
getting it in there without scraping it along the metal back brackets. It's very important. So the heavyweight boat is getting put on the trailer on the outboard rigging. Just like it took everybody to do it. And they'll strap it down well so it doesn't fall off during the run.